welcome back to SB Ramble On. So we are doing um, some canvas projects, even though we don't know how to sew. So we bought a sale right sewing machine and decided to actually we actually tried to hire somebody to sail or to sew a bunch of canvas for us and he was a real piece of garbage so he took our sail or cover for our binnacle and took it all apart made a pattern and made a new one and came back and didn't fit and then we didn't pay him for it but now we don't have anything here he just disappeared um so anyway we decided we have other things to make so let's buy a sewing machine and I used to sew when I was little, but I haven't sewn since 30 years. It's been like 30 years. I was in, I think I was like in high school. So anyway. So um, pretty much like everything on this boat, if you want it done right, we end up having to do it ourselves. So luckily, Sailrite uh, has a really good YouTube channel where you can, they can show you how to do all this stuff. And so we decided to start something difficult, like a big giant binnacle cover. But they have like an hour long video. So anyway, I'm not going to recreate the video. I'm just going to kind of show you basically what we did. We followed their steps. We put tape around this to be able to get our patterning material that we have here. Um, so if you look at their video, you'll see that they put tape on here, tape on here, tape on here to kind of be able to drape the patterning material across. And then basically... What's that uh, that's stuff what, called? Uh, patterning material. I don't know. So okay. anyway, we basically like came up with, you know, some pieces. So here's like the front part or the back part that goes here. There's a zipper in between. There's a piece that goes along the back here. And you know, just basically you, you put it on here and, mid and, and stick it on there and then cut it out. And then you make one piece that goes across this section. So it's basically it's three pieces. It's this piece, there's a piece that goes all the way like that, and then one over here, and it has a zipper. So this is our final cover. So we have, here's our piece that goes like this, here's the one that goes here, and then the big one that goes around there. Um, the only thing we didn't do was the shot cord on the bottom, and their binnacle cover was a little different than ours. It didn't have this that came all the way down. Theirs came in, so it was, they needed something to cinch it here. We actually don't need that because ours is tapered. It has those straight bars at the side, so when you put it on, it fits, I swear. It fit yesterday. fit a little better. I mean, it could be, I wish we had made this a little bit bigger, maybe here, so that it would sit a little bit more like that. But I think it's fine. Yeah. Sure this side, this side's the better side. I think it looks pretty good. Yeah, it's actually tapers. I guess that's yeah, the aft good. side of it. So you can see, um, if there was a shock cord, it would hold it in place. But ours, because it's tapered, mm -hmm. it's not coming off. No. So we don't really need the shock cord, so I didn't put it in. Yeah. Anyway, that's one project down. I don't know what we're going to do next. Is yeah, that, you do. We got winch covers. You want to do a couple winch covers. Rich wants to do a sail bag for the staysail. Um, and then maybe some sheet bags. And we'll see.